Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is a look at my cleaning caddy. Um, first thing I just thought I'd say hi, how are you all? And I've got to do question of the day as well, ask my new thing. So question of the day is, answers in the comment box below, is would you rather watch Wather? Would you rather watch the sunrise or the sunset? My answer is the sun set because I am up watching that sunset most mornings at the time my children wake up so I think I'll go with sunset don't tend to watch a lot of those and they're pretty beautiful beautiful experiences so that's my answer so cleaning caddy here it is here this bad boy this massive thing it fits so much in it's really good so I got it from eBay I'm doing another video for you guys um, either I'll film it after this one and put it up before this one or I'll film it and put it on after I've done this video. I'm not sure which way around. Um, but yeah, I hope you, hope you understood that. I uh, am gonna do a series on eBay finds. So I did it on my blog where I did fashion finds on eBay, beauty finds and homeware finds, and basically just like found stuff on eBay and linked it all and uh, um, yeah, basically, so you guys can kind of, so having to find everything or even think about stuff that might be on eBay. I know I didn't think of half the stuff I found was on eBay, it was on eBay. Um, it's such amazing prices. So basically, I'm going to do um, a series on it. So I'm going to do one on organisational things, which is what this caddy is going to be included in. And I'll do another one on, I don't know, maybe homeware bits, another one on cleaning bits, etc. So let me know if you guys are interested in that kind of series or not, if you would want to watch that. So that's an idea I've got in my head, which hopefully I'll film quite soon so let's just get on with it because I've rambled loads so my cleaning caddy is from eBay really really big and fits loads and loads in so what I tend to do is I get this out pop the bits that I'm going to need in and just go around the house if I have the ability to with my little tribe of children so this is the first thing I'll talk about this is a little duster really handy because you can just get it in between all those little nooks and crannies because if you've got a tiny little space you can just kind of slide it through that space, it's really good. Um, super fluffy, you can get these from Poundland, I'm sure that's where I got this one from. And I'm sure I saw them at Home Bargains as well. Um, but yeah, I don't know what the brand is because I haven't got the box anymore and it doesn't say anywhere. But you can get these reusable bits here. Um, yeah, it's really, really good, really handy. So definitely try and see if you guys can grab something like this, really good. Next is my bottle. This is an empty method bottle and what I do is I fill it up with flora and water and then I've got my own antibacterial spray. I tend to use this on the toilet and on any other surface as well because it just works everywhere. I've got the peach one in today. Oh my God, I love the new summer scents. They're really lovely. So yeah, there's this that I have in there. So I use that everywhere. Sorry about the sound of the traffic. Next is this Viacal, I think that's how you say it, lime scale remover. So I tend to use this where I spray it on the sinks and spray it in the bathroom and then I'll go around the rest of the house. This has got the Febreze freshness scent in it and honestly it makes such a difference because the original Viacal, I don't like the smell of it at all, it's so strong. But that extra Febreze scent in it just kind of takes that edge off, it's really nice. So yeah, it's really, really good this. And you can get this from Poundland or from Home Bargains. I think I've got mine from Home Bargains. Next is Blue Flowers Sweet Tulip Toilet Cleaner. Again, what I tend to do, go into the toilets, just shove a bit down there and do the rest of the house and then go back and like scrub it. Um, but yeah, absolutely love this. It makes your toilet pink and smelling lush. So there's that. Then I've got, as you can tell, I have a favourite brand and that's Astonish. Um, so this is the Mould and Mildew Blaster. I've got hardly any left in it and I'm gutted because I can't seem to find it anywhere at the moment. I got this one from Poundland and I absolutely love this stuff. So if you guys know where I found it recently anywhere, please, please let me know because this is my favourite stuff. This was only a pound in Poundland and it's Mould and Mildew Blaster. It's amazing. I just spray it, leave it for a little while. Then with my toothbrush I then just kind of scrub out all the lime scale and all the dirt and it's just such an amazing product it works so well and I've got to barely use much elbow grease it's just so good as so that then I've also got my toothbrush that I use like I just said just to kind of get in all the little areas that is just like tricky like around the tap and stuff in between the tiles so yeah I just got a pack of five from I think it was home bargains for less than a pound so yeah love having a toothbrush I also have what should I use next astonish again daily shower shower because I couldn't find the mold and mildew blaster I thought I'd pick this one up and give it a whirl it's not our good but it's still really really good um, I just love Astonish and this I think might have been from Home Bargains um, yeah really good product again you cannot beat Astonish at all it's just my favourite brand at the moment slightly obsessed with them next I've always got to have some dispersible toilet wipes I've always got to have them around the house literally top 
and underneath the, the rim of the toilet and everywhere I can, <laughs> I will use those and they are um, flushables, how you say it? Flushable? Yeah, you can flush them. They break up basically when you flush it. So um, yeah, I love those. And these Tesco ones, these Tesco's, no, Sainsbury's, they are my favourite ones. I haven't actually gotten here, I realised, I think I must have ran out. I've always got Tesco citrus antibacterial wipes, that's why I thought those were them. Um, I love those wipes and I think I must have run out because I've always got a pack here unless if the husband's taken them and miraculously cleaned and leave them somewhere. I haven't seen them anywhere. But yeah, I love this and I always have wipes with me as well. Then I've got this, which is my new favourite Method product. It's Method Limited Edition Multi-Surface Cleaner in Pink Pomelo. It smells amazing. Um, it's got rose gold pretty packaging as well. I think I must have got this on offer somewhere, but you can get it pretty much anywhere. Tesco, Sainsbury's, any supermarket. But yeah, I love that stuff as well. And I use that mainly in the kitchen and in like the living room because it smells so lovely. Whereas bathroom and the kitchen, I tend to use more like the Astonish or the Viacal or I also have um, Miser Flora that I use as well so yeah but that tends to be living room or um, yeah any other area apart from the kitchen or the, the bathroom. Next is Astonish Fabric Refresher, I love this stuff, I literally spray it on my sofa and all on the curtains and any other furnishings, just makes it fresh and smelling lovely and you can smell it when you walk into the room, it's cotton fresh scent which is really nice so yeah love that stuff, again I think that might have been Home Bargains or Poundland not expensive at all then in this little corner here just there i always have my carpet fresh or shake and vac i'm going to do a review on this versus shake and vac so i'm not going to say which is my favorite yet but um yeah this is a nice scent it's thai orchid and passion fruit and you literally just spray it on you don't need to hoover it up but i tend to spray it on around the house then i'll do the cleaning bit and then i hoover it all up so yeah there's that a thousand and one that was i think home bargains it's not that expensive i do go through that a lot though um, not a, not a little, a little does not go a long way. Does that make sense? Yes, it does. Next is an e cloth. I always, always have one of these just to kind of sp like um, mop down any of the spray that I've used or um, to dust if I haven't got my little duster to hand. But yeah, I love my e cloths. My my little cloths are my best friends. Next is a, and I always call these J cloths because my mum calls them J cloths, but I think these are like multi multi purpose wipes or something, multi purpose cloths or something. But yeah, you can get these from anywhere. I just again use these from the bathroom or the kitchen if I've got to have a damp area. These work really well, so I would always have that spare. Sometimes on the toilet when I've done my, if I haven't got my antibacterial wipes, I'll just spray my Sephora on and I'll use that wipe and then I'll just chuck it away. Next is this Airwick Pure um, in Cherry Blossom Spray. Love this stuff. This is like one of my best friends now. Spray this in all the rooms when I finish and it just leaves the house smelling amazing. So yeah, I definitely would recommend this. And they have lots of different scents that I'm yet to try. So yeah, but so far, Cherry Blossom, I am loving. It's like a sweet, like fruity kind of scent but it's not too in your face if that makes sense. Next I always have to have a bottle of Sephora in here because I like to put this down the toilet. If I haven't used my duck scrub, which I tend to use quite often, um, if not then I will just pop a capful of this in my um, the toilet basin and I also do a steam clean in my kitchen and my bathroom so I'll put boiling water in the sink, pop a capful or more of this in there and then I leave it to kind of do its work and to fill the room with the scent. And this one is Honeysuckle and Jasmine which is really nice but not one of my favourites I don't think so the summer ones are definitely taken over um, my favourite scents of Sephora. So yeah there's that which you can get from pretty much anywhere. Next is a little bit of Magic Eraser. I cut these all up. I've done a video on Magic Erasers and all the ways I, diff I use it. So I'll try and make sure I link that in the description box below so you can watch it. Um, whoops. But yeah, I tend to use it on all sorts of different things. So yeah, just go and watch that video and then you can see where I use that. And the last thing is a bin bag just because I like to collect all the crap that seems to, you know, come around in the house along my way. There's always something somewhere that shouldn't be where it is and needs to be going on the bin or recycled or whatever. So that is my cleaning caddy. I hope you guys have liked that and I will make sure that I do a video on my eBay funds very very soon and you take care guys. Bye!